And thus it came to pass that the Emperor Elvin Green was banished from the Colosseum by Samuel, Angel of Death and Prince of Rome. Wow. What is going on, geeks? Unite the Clans here, back in your life with another episode of Californium. We are racing towards the finish. If you are just tuning into this series now, you've made a huge mistake. It's really weird and really complex. Go back and watch from the beginning. We're about to enter our own museum in the fourth of several realities we've uncovered for ourselves. Uh, this one takes place on Mars, and we are looking at a couple of really weird people. You're not my ex-wife. You're the old... Un you're the... Welcome to your museum, Commander. You seem surprised. Did you think you'd find your mate here? You protect her, even though she wants to chop your head off? Well... Human emotions really do lead to all sorts of contradictions. The Great Council has just voted to give full powers to the Consul. Who quickly Who's on the Great loyalty. Council? This Don fellow will be a big help in cleansing our planet. Our planet? Then he'll join the rest of you humans in the trash can of history. You're You'll not soon human. be officially assassinated by the BioH Trauberg, and this absurd museum will be raised to the ground. Oh my god. You don't belong in our world anymore, Green. Wow, what a weird place this is, I guarantee you. There's a TV with an Omega symbol on it, and we just need to find it. There. A really trippy Abe. A soldier. Synth. A bunch of synths. Okay. Elevator? Is that what you are? Yep. Yes, indeed. And I hear the TV already. Where are we at? Where are we at? Where? There. Okay. Four. There are four symbols in this place that we're going to reveal with glitches, and I think we're close as hell to the end of this game. I don't know what's waiting for us. I don't see any up here. Let's head down to the main floor and see if we can't find all four down here. Okay. Glitch. Glitch. This is a strange place. I don't see any. There's no obvious ones. Come Oh, there you go. That's going to open up the start. Oh yeah. Get clicked on. The start of who knows what. Okay, I need to find more. I need to get to whatever world we're about to reveal. Because look at the crazy things that happen inside it. There. Get glitched. Whoa. Is that the same Abe? Maybe. It's a moon rover. These are little spaceships, right? These are the domes, and that's the great drill. This is a very, very odd little game. Man, am I glad I picked this up for whatever the hell it cost, eight, nine bucks. Now, uh-uh. Now, are those flickering in a specific pattern? If so, I don't have the mental capacity to figure out what it is. Come on, tell me there's more symbols waiting around here for me. If not, I'll have to go back upstairs. And I didn't see any upstairs.
This must have something to do with something. Something to do with something. I'm so good at breaking stuff down. Making it so it's straightforward and easy for you to understand. This must have something to do with something. Alright, where are these damn symbols? Maybe I have to be up top to see it. Or maybe one of these little display cases is a glitch. You. You're gonna be weird. No? Not weird at all. Come on, let's give me something out here. Three left, really? Two, right. Two left. Jeez, I'm having trouble. All right, let me go see what I can find. There's one. How many times do I have to look at that thing before that happened? That means there could be one out here. Probably not. But definitely something on this side of the building. You feel like there ought to be. Alright, let's go back downstairs. Let's see if one won't, won't show itself to us. None there. Three. He's looking at a three. No, I don't know what he's doing. Come on, tell me there's a symbol up in this. Somewhere up in here. What is this guy thinking while well, I'm just going around looking for symbols that nobody but me can see? Green. Oh yeah, one of the O's. One of the O's could be an Omega. There are some things you can only see when you're in a particular position. Like you have to be near them for them to even pop up. So maybe I'm just not exploring enough of the sides or the back edges of this stuff. I see nothing. Whoa. You just see something? Whoa. Whoa. This game... You know what? If anything, this is a really simple mechanic. Go find the symbols and click on them, right? But they've done a really elegant way making you find them. Like, they've come up with a thousand ways to hide these symbols from you, and it's kind of brilliant. That just flashed in. And thus in. it came to pass that the Emperor Elvin Green was banished from the Colosseum by Samuel, Angel of Death and Prince of Rome. Wow. Father, the process is starting over again. What does that mean? Exponential amplification of the mutation. Artificial synapse is implemented. Stochastic modeling of neurons. Synaptic interconnections. What? Cortical correlation. Unidentified cognitive process is emerging. Transmigration complete. What? Process is emerging. Transmigration complete. Father, I... I am. I am. Very moving, this Alice uncovering the secrets of the conscience. But there's not enough time to witness this singularity. Neither you nor I nor she is here to understand, Elvin. What? There is no master plan. Father? Yeah? Is this conscience? Being able to ask, who am I? What? One, two, three, your loss crushes me. Four, five, six, where are you, Alice? One, two, three. Scared of what I'll be. Four, five, six. We'll meet by the sticks. What will happen to poor little Alice, who was just born out of digital limbo, if you die? We each have our own hell, Elvin. Am I an implant inhabited by the spirit of young Alice? Ah. Uh, Alice herself? I have no idea. The world whose secrets you are preparing to unveil seems strange to me, Alvin. I sense a loss of synchronicity. The dimensions of time are becoming dangerously unstable. Are you sure you Damn want it. to continue? The symbol is disconnecting me. What? It's scrambling all of the fluxes. What? I don't want to lose you. It's erasing me. I wish I had... What? 
Answer. Answer for yourself, Centurion. What is this? This is the end, Commander. You gave us life, and now we're about to take yours. We don't have your sense of humor, but still, <laughs> we can appreciate the irony of this situation. I bet you can. Now, I've seen this before, and I know how this is going to go down. Up here, on our balcony. Lord. Talk about a trippy ass game. I knew it was gonna be weird. I didn't know it was gonna be this weird. I thought we were gonna spend most of our time in the 60s doing mind warping drugs. Values running around like a rat in your final resting place. Accept your fate, Green. If you were any more than a cardboard cutout who just followed me everywhere, I, no matter where I stood, you continued to face me like total 2D loser then I would be worried, but I'm not because look. We're about to get some other effing answers right now. See ya, Shine. I said see ya, Shine. Hey, narrator, can you? There you go. Get us out of here. Achievement unlocked Mars. Is this the end of the damn game? If so, if not, it's longer than I frickin' thought. We are in yet another world. The one without gravity. Um, I take it I'm just gonna have to make this look right. I can, can I do that from in my, no. Yes. Santa Ana Ambulance Dispatch. Where are we, Elvin? I have no it's idea. Hospitable here. I have All around no us, idea. Nothing but ruins and entropy. Yet I did warn you, Elvin. One should not meddle with multiple universes. Oh, you're just actual 2D now. You don't even follow me as I move. You're a freaking cardboard cutout. And this whole reality that I've created in my mind, I think it's about to dissolve. And we're gonna find out if it was in my damn mind. Come on, I gotta be moving or something? There you go. I have to be not moving. And yet another hole opens up. Staircase, yep. Yeah, this is weird. Chaos. Chaos. Did I not warn you that messing with- I have seen worlds beyond your understanding, Elvin, but never such chaos. Never have I seen such chaos. <laughs> Right. We're hearing EMTs talk about how I'm going to survive or not survive. Yes. Yes. Yes, yes. There's a way to line this up right now. As tongue-tied as ever, my dear Elvin. <laughs> Seems the that way. The world is collapsing before your very eyes, yet you continue to juggle with the secrets of creation. Yep. I know not what else to do, rather than just keep pushing forward. Why do you persist? Forward. Perhaps you believe in a superior being, Elvin. According to you, the eight spirits of Hermopolis will arise from the icy waters of this shapeless and abstract world. You can only hope, Lord. Philip K. Dick. Oh, I feel my forces waning. Elvin, could you please halt this frenzied pursuit? You continue to wander through this labyrinth as if everything were normal. Take the time to think about what you're doing. You think you're the creator of the world, but you're merely a puppet. I've gone silent, uh, as often happens in the epic conclusions to story-driven games. Nothing I can say can keep up with what we've just experienced. 
we're peeling back the layers of reality. Uh, there's talk. Whoa. Whoa. This world is collapsing. It's not good for either one of us. Let me make a suggestion. We end the experiment. I make my report, and you go back to the peaceful what life you once had. What do you say, Elvin? Sounds a whole lot like the Stanley Parable guy trying to talk me out of doing what comes next. I don't know if I was supposed to be up here. I don't know. Let's carry on. You're a weirdo. Yeah, the games like this, I didn't know what to expect from this one, and I'm not sure I can put it on a level with some of the other great narrated games I've played, but... No, oh, Elvin! You are nothing but an ungrateful wretch! Without me, you would still be that pathetic homunculus caught in the trap of existence. You're going to feel very lonely. I was beginning to like you, Elvin. Uh-huh. Holy crap. I just had to reload the game, guys. If it lets me in this elevator, we're good. And it does. And up we go. Yeah, the game, I guess I got in the elevator and then I had to go back hmm, down and melt that last one. My friend. I'm not your Virgil, and you are certainly not Dante. Yeah, I broke it by jumping Ooh, too far Mars, ahead. Like a Roman emperor, we are the hollow man. We are the stuffed men. Whatever the narrator is, is breaking down as what quickly right. the as the world around us. Set in the multiple dimensions of time. He's fallen apart, whatever he is. He's... We're being led upwards. To where? I don't know. Time to write the epilogue. Oh, god damn. Please, lead me to the end. This is a trip that has gone on long One, enough. Two, three, your loss crushes me. Yep. Four, five, six, where are you at? Jesus. This has blown me right the hell away. I thought psychedelic, I got it in droves. I thought freaky, I got that in droves. I thought story driven, I don't know what the story is, but it definitely has, has had one. And here we are, approaching what must be the end. Aha! Aha! There, as fast as we can go. Holy crap. This game is epic. This is definitively epic. It's bigger and grander than anything I've played in a long time. Achievement unlocked chaos. Let's just enjoy the light show. Okay, well, I that ended on me. I thought we were gonna get an ending. Maybe we get it now. Oh yes, I'm in the dark and approaching one small light thing that's far away. I've been here before. This is very Stanley Parable-esque. Where am I headed? What am I moving towards? It's a desk. It's a desk in a room. Is there gonna be a typewriter on it? Is there a book I need to write? Why does it look so weird? Omega. Yep. Yep. Night. We're not back in 1960 with a book called Martian Minds on our desks, are we? If anything comes on this TV, I'm gonna grab a gun and blow Elvin's brains out. Is that landlady still out here? No, the whole street is quiet. There's not even cars. 
It looks normal. Where are we? Whoa. Uh-huh. Shake it off, Elvin. Bullshit. Bullshit, I'm not doing this again. I'm not peeling back reality. I'll stay here. I'll stay in this place. I'll stay here forever. It's fine. I'll learn to write a book. I'll stop drinking. I'll stop doing drugs. I'll get back together with my wife. We'll mourn the loss of our child together. I do not want to go back to Mars. And thankfully, I will not have to. Uh, even the credits are glitching out. Geeks, thank you so much for joining me on this trip. And it certainly has been one. I expected a very weird game, and we got it. Uh, I hope you have joined me for this whole series and enjoyed the whole thing. If you tuned in somewhere in the middle, go start at the beginning. It's the only way you'll get to really appreciate Californium. I've had a blast playing it, uh, and I appreciate everybody tuning in. Thank you, and uh, I will be back with a brand new series for you in just a couple of days. TV. The TV. That's what's making all the noise. That's Omega? It looks like it's the end of the line for you, Mr. Green. Wow, narrator it's comes into the game. Writer's block. A brain corroded by mind-bending drugs and dime store alcohol.